Hello viewers, thank you very much for tuning in and today we're having a look at the Skywatcher Skyhawk 114 EQ telescope and uh, not to be confused with a couple of others that look very similar this is the model number 10921 and I, I will give details about the specification, the full specification in the description below so at around about £150 or so this is designed at the beginner or if you want a second telescope for when out on your travels and you want something portable and it's very lightweight and very easy to move. So it comes with a couple of eyepieces to get you started which give you 40 times which is ideal for looking at ritual star clusters and basically just finding your way around the night sky and getting used to focusing. And also a 10mm eyepiece, the first eyepiece was a 25mm one by the way, the second one is a 10mm which gives 100 times magnification and that will be perfect for looking at craters on the moon, the rings around Saturn and uh, some of its brighter satellites and also the four brightest moons around Jupiter and on a, a good night uh, a couple of the larger cloud belts and other planets that you'll be able to see as little disks are Venus, Mars and Mercury and don't forget the hundreds of double stars that this telescope will show. It's a, even though it's got a short tube, it's actually 1000mm focal length, even though it's only half a metre long. And that's because inside here there is a little lens which doubles the magnification, much like a Barlow lens does. And that makes a 500mm tube into a 1000mm focal length. That has its advantages and disadvantages. The advantages, you get more magnification for each eyepiece. The disadvantages, you may, may lose a little bit of your sharpness and brightness compared to the slightly higher priced parabolic version. As it's a... Newtonian, the image will be upside down back to front, but don't worry about that because all stars and planets are around anyway, so that shouldn't really make much difference. And it and thinking opposite when you move it around looking through the eyepiece, you'll soon get used to that. Comes with a, a red dot finder, which is twin pin connection, so bear that in mind should you wish to upgrade to a a visual finder in the future, which which probably need the, the hot shoe connection comes with the e Skywatch EQ1 mount very very easy to set up and use as you can see I'm hardly yeah that's a couple of fingers there finger and thumb very easy to move and it does come with the slow motion controls for that fine adjustment when you're looking through the eyepiece and you want to keep things centered in view so that's it that's the Skywatch Skyhawk 114 EQ telescope model number 10921 great little starter scope for around about £150 perfect as a gift idea or if you've got a larger telescope yourself and you want a second one for when out on your travels so thank you very much for watching as always and please check out the links in the description below